Hello everybody, my name is V. Narendra Kumar and we are from NRK and today our piece is called Why or What to be Enjoy in Art? Uh, art, any art. This is the most difficult question to actually put in words. To put in words. But the answer to this question could be the simplest. When we see a movie, for example, we like it. Why? Why? We simply like it. But to know why we like what we like in stories, movies, even paintings, if somebody could ex maybe explain and teach us to see them properly, music too, then it would be to know so much and we would derive such great sheer pleasure from life and living. Because you see, art is life. Essentialized by an artist as he sees the world, as he truly sees the world. And see now the strange fact, if an artist at that moment of seeing truly sees, of seeing, truly seeing, not concerned about what he has to do to please etc. Simply he sees at that moment and puts it all on paper huh? or expresses it. Simply that moment when he sees that thing is art in its most beautiful expression simply because it is that artist's essential core nature and in that moment he has revealed himself for all to see and also later is his, whole, his own self. As he continues to write, sing, dance, draw, on and on, as he does and does, he slowly becomes truer, clearer and open. And a day comes when he has emptied out everything from within him. He has nothing with him. He not only has created, he has in the process studied and absorbed and understood, seen all great art by his own eyes and mind. The day he has nothing with him begins another journey. The art becomes a kind of divine thing, a sublime thing, a thing of ecstasy. He sees certain visions that have to be put down and he does, he, he does oblivious to the world, yet expressing that world freely, creating, finding those precious moments of such beauty, joy and meaning, most of all, that makes him ascend to a plane where his very sight, his working experience, his utter trained honesty, his love for this earth and everything in it and all of his self and the full whole experience is put down, brought out into a broad daylight. He laughs now. He has seen, been liberated and the creations have become infinite. Such beauty, such ecstasy, such love is what makes art the greatest, most whole work. That is the meaning of art which uh, we have expressed here. Thank you so much.